Hey guys, had to come outside and talk to you. Oh God, um, this has been like the worst I've been since it started. Um, this, I've been here for two weeks now and my symptoms are the highest they've been in a long time. I'm just outside this lovely um, Italian restaurant um, and even though I felt my symptoms were quite bad, um, we didn't have any food in the house. We, we needed to go to the supermarket and my boyfriend had been drinking and we couldn't go out in the car. And so he's like, let's go out. And he said I could do with going out. So we've come out to this lovely Italian restaurant. The food is amazing. I'm sitting there and I feel like I'm gonna die. My vision has just gone. My ears are ringing. My chest feels like someone stood on it. I've got pins and needles all throughout my body. And I'm sitting there just feeling like I'm gonna fall over off the chair. And I'm trying to look normal and he's talking to me and I'm just like, what? You know, I can't even, this is just so hard. I don't understand what's going on, you know? I'm, I've got my medication weeks ago now. I know you guys are just gonna say it's a setback and you'll be fine tomorrow. And, but this has been consistently bad for days weeks actually you know and like I said to you before I'm just so glad that I'm not actually paying for this because it would be a waste of money I couldn't I mean I could go away but I'm not enjoying it I'm not you know I mean this wasn't meant to be an enjoyable thing I'm just gonna try and sit down and I'm gonna rock this is just really so I'm smoking as well which I shouldn't be but my god I'm so stressed out you know um, I said I'd update you if anything significant happened. I'm just, I'm feeling really sorry for my behalf. I, I, he's fine, but you know, I'm sitting in there thinking, right, what do I do? Come on, we're in the moment now. My symptoms were a 9.5. Let's do some parasympathetic breathing. And then he starts talking to me. And I'm like, look, I need to do 20 breaths. Can you just give me about 10 minutes without talking? And he sort of rolls his eyes. Like, okay, do whatever you need to do. And I'm sitting there and I just can't do it. I just can't do it. Then I'm trying to do progressive muscle relaxation. I'm in a restaurant. It doesn't work. It doesn't work when I'm out. You know, and I, and I don't want to fight it. And then I've got clear weeks in my head saying, loosen and accept, loosen and accept. I'm doing that and it's just making the situation worse. You know, my symptoms are worse. It's like they're getting angry at me. I don't know what message they're trying to give me, whether I need to stay in bed. I mean, you know, I'm trying, I'm doing all these things. I'm out, I'm, you know, I slept so much yesterday. Yesterday was a horrendous day. Um, I was really bad. I mean, I couldn't walk unaided yesterday. That's how bad it's been. <sighs> Dr. Yo, if you're watching, any advice on this one? You know, it's in the moment. Um, I'm trying everything, you know? I'm trying name five things and, you know, trying to get in with my senses, but it's just overbearing. It's, it's, I'm maxed out. I'm, actually, I'm in a situation where I shouldn't, shouldn't be stressed, but I am. Um, but yesterday I was so bad that I said to my boyfriend, look, I'm gonna have to go to bed. And this was like midday. And I just laid in bed and I woke up at half five. So on top of a full night's sleep, I then had another five and a half hours because there was just no point being awake. I couldn't do anything I needed to do in the house. As you know, I'm here to repair and sort out my dad's property. Maybe this is just all stress and it's just manifesting. I don't know. But I'm so sick of this. Anyway, I'm sorry it's not a positive update, guys. It's just, um, just is what it is. I guess um, but I just need to be able to handle these situations properly and, and feel something you know that I'm doing is it gonna actually affect it and calm it down but parasympathetic breathing isn't working for me because I can't do it enough I can't do 20 breaths in a restaurant <sighs> I don't know anyway I'm sorry guys um, I just I did say I'd update you and I'm trying to be as real as possible about how things are, you know? And this is one whopper of a setback, two week setback. 
Anyway, love you and leave you a nice good show on Sunday. All right, bye.